speaking of love and like staying out of people's business, I just, I want to just dig into your business a little bit. Sometimes you get lesbian vibes. You give me like stud vibes. I think this is a (laughs) secret fantasy of Raven. I think she just wants everyone to be gay. And she's just really hoping you're going to come out right here, right now. So women have been asking me this for as long as I've been around. It's like, what do you care who I I love? It's Bryce Davis on the check-in. And we got Whoopi Goldberg on the best podcast ever, hosted by Raven Simone, I believe her wife, Miranda. And you know, Whoopi was a guest. And of course, Raven had to pop the question. Are you gay? Now, a lot of y'all know Whoopi Goldberg to be a pretty manly looking woman. But at the same time, I don't think nobody ever cared enough to actually wonder about her sexuality. I mean, she was married to three different men and has had no history with women. She even has a child, you know, which happens to be a daughter. So, you know, the question about her sexuality, man, it, 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 it's, it seems kind of invasive, you know, but since raven's gay it kind of gives her the okay to ask versus if anybody else were to ask you already know what would have happened you know it'd be all problems if they were to do that but you know she pretty much let it be known like y'all don't swing that way blah 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 whatever the case may be but i swear the lbgt hd tv community no i'm playing but i think they should be like part of the army you know what i mean like they're so good at like recruiting people I think they, they're needed for the uh, military or something because they sure know how to recruit and advertise, that's for sure. And, you know, it's nothing against them. I have no issue with that. But it does seem like there's a, uh, I don't want to call it an agenda, but it does seem like they're always trying to make that a big deal. Like, as a straight guy, I don't go around wondering somebody's sexuality. I mean, Whoopi and Raven, they were co-hosts together on The View for about a year, I believe. You know, I never watched the show, so, you know, don't don't think I know anything because, you know, I honestly don't even be touching on topics like this. But, you know, I just thought I'd give my little two cents about it. Like, you know, just because, you know, there are some manly looking women out there don't mean that they all swing that way just because they look that way. and. They might be a little bit more on the masculine side as far as how they dress, talk, things like that. But, you know, if they if if they like women, then, you know, you don't got to push it out of them to say otherwise. You know what I mean? Or if they like men, vice versa, whatever. You know, I don't think, you know, you should over question somebody's sexuality, especially somebody that's your elder. I mean, Raven, she's like 36, 37 years old. Whoopi got to be in her 60s or I'd say 70s. My fault. I don't know how old she is, 60s, 70s, something like that. And like to ask her, that just seemed kind of disrespectful. But at the same time, you know, it's 2020, you know, you can do what you want. Hey, who am I? I was raised different. Let me know how y'all feel about it in the comments. Y'all agree, disagree, whatever the case may be. And of course, if you like the video, make sure you like and subscribe.